You have Scott Miller here through SVI Trucks. We're gonna talk about how to service your ROM roll-up doors. When you have a ROM roll-up door, you want them to open freely, but not retract all the way up. You want them to go halfway. If not, you wanna adjust the barrel on the back side. Now, to clean your ROM roll-up doors, these are anodized aluminum doors, so if you get any salt or grime on them, you wanna get that salt off of there, otherwise the anodization will start pitting on you. When you get into servicing and cleaning these, you'll have little rubber gaskets in between each door. Uh, if you use a pressure washer, those rubber gaskets can actually get blown out, so you wanna make sure to hand wash all of these rubber seals. A few things to keep in mind is if you wash them with the soap, you want to use a mild soap with a pH level between six and nine. And if you have a painted door, you want to use the cleaning solutions that the paint companies recommend. When you do clean these, you want to not use a pressure washer. You want to hand wash them. And what you would want to do is clean your tracks on the sides, clean your skirt up on top of the door, and also you want to clean this rubber seal at the bottom to make sure you keep water out. What's important is you have plastic shoes on the ends of these doors that rub in these tracks. So if you do have dirt and grime, it can wear those shoes out faster than later. When you re-lube these tracks, you want to use a non-petroleum based product, such as a dry silicone for those sides. On the ROM roll-up doors, if you go to add graphics on them, uh, you want to use a 50-50 mix of uh, rubbing alcohol to water and clean the doors thoroughly and that way the graphics can build adhesive onto the door. If you keep the doors clean, it will last you for years to come.